Hey guys, Jason Nedved here with Nedved Precision Shooting. We're gonna go over real quick how to shoot a spinner with a centerfire rifle. Uh, I'll show you how to measure it, shooting a centerfire at the spinner and shooting a rimfire at a spinner. Uh, kind of the same idea, uh, but a little different. And we'll show that uh, in another video. But right now we're just gonna focus on centerfire. So I got a spinner out there. So what we're gonna do, if you look at the trigger cam footage here, what you need to do is measure it. So you put your reticle on that, on your target, right? And you can see we're measuring just a, below the two right here. You see that center bar right here is where we're looking. That's what I'm measuring. So center target to that. So if I look at two, it's not gonna be quite there. But if I do that, I just need to be above the two or below the two. So my two, is gonna be my reference point. Like the actual number two needs to be sitting on that bar. See how that works? So that's what I'm gonna be looking at when I shoot this. So we'll see if we can't get this spun real quick and we gotta be quick about it. Because what we need to do is you need to shoot before it gets below, like it is right there. You need to shoot when it's up in the air. So we'll, we'll show that here. that two above there, Get that two above right there, and spun, okay? So we didn't have to be super quick on it. Uh, all those are nicely placed. You could have went a little lower if anything, but we got it spun in three shots. We're, we're happy with it. So let me just show you what I did. So I put that two, my vertical right here, right above this crossbar. So I hovered that two right up here, just above it, and we hit it. That's a big plate. So we can be off a couple tenths. It's not gonna be a big deal. So the big thing when they say, shooter ready, yeah, and they don't let you see the target beforehand, which is normal, you lay down, you're not gonna run out of time. Even if it's a 90 second stage, you're not gonna run out of time. Take the time, look at your target here, okay? Measure it. All right, I need to shoot there. I need to have the two right above that crossbar. We're good to go. Okay, so that's what we're looking at. That's what we mean by measure it. And then when I am pulling the trigger, you notice how it was up and on its way swinging down, just from the angle I'm at. And when it was swinging down like that, it was swinging down. When it was up here is when I needed to pull that trigger because the bullet flight time, I need to predict that. You know, it tells you in your kestrels and all that stuff. But when it was up here, I needed to pull the trigger because then my bullet will reach it when it's right here. So that's what we're looking at. That's how when people just, when you're at a uh, course of fire at a match and they say just measure it, that's what we're measuring. We're not trying to track that because you're gonna be hovering. Again, let's look at this trigger cam footage. You're gonna be following it like this. It's gonna be up and then it's gonna be down. It's gonna be up, it's gonna be down. No, we just need to look at that crossbar right there because that's not gonna move. We just need to shoot like that right there. Let's just do it one more time because we can. Put that two above there. And you see how I kind of led that when it was falling. Don't try to rush that shot. If you are not ready, do not rush it, okay? Wait for it as long as you got a little momentum in there. Just stay on it, boom, boom, okay? Just like that. Super easy, because um, everybody asks, this is an ACC chassis, Terminus Zeus. I like it because of that 60 degree throw, super quick, uh, with the six dasher pre-fit on there, a uh, quick change. Uh, absolutely love it, runs very well. We got a couple in stock. Then obviously running the Gen 3 Razor, got those in stock also, but this is my center fire setup as well. So we'll go over in another video how to shoot a 22 spinner. It's same kind of basic idea, but you need to pull the trigger at a different point. Uh, so we'll show that in another video. Uh, hopefully you liked the video. If you have other examples of things that you struggled with at a match, let me know and uh, we'll get it set up out here and shoot it. Thanks guys.